Good morning, everybody. It is the day after. Let me get it. It's Mother's Day. What day is that? May 9th. We're going to head in here, same place we were yesterday. And uh, we'll get the girlfriend with, so if them Jake come in, it should be a good time. So stay tuned. We're running a little bit late, so I'll see you in the woods. They're fighting. She just stayed at the truck.
All right, everybody. So I just want to give you a quick rundown of what happened this morning. As I'm sitting here now, after everything's done and said with, um, I now realize that I didn't get the shot on video. Um, what had happened is there was a berm there, and the birds come around that berm, and they actually come up from the bottom. When last I knew where they were, they were above us, so they come up below us. Um, so what happened is they come up from below us, caught me off guard, and I'm pretty sure I double punch a record button. So that's why the shot's not on video. Um, I just wanted to explain kind of what happened. So enjoy the rest of the video. I love the small gunpowder in the barn. Look at that. Your first bird. Yeah. Do you know how long I've been trying to kill you a freaking turkey? I think that's my fourth year out. Did you hear them fighting up there? Yeah, that was crazy. I can't believe that just happened. I am I so freaking happy. I'm happy it happened that quick because I didn't have time to get nervous or nothing. Well, I love when it happens quick. <laughs> Goodness. Look at that. Got a bird. Or Jake. <laughs> I'm so freaking happy for you. I'm very happy too. I didn't even see them come down. No, neither. I thought they were going to come down. I was only sitting. I don't know, even know where I was sitting. I'll have to go find my gun, but... And the decoys are right there, so I think... They have to be right there. back here. Yeah. So they probably couldn't even see the decoys until they got to about here. We finally made it happen. What a freaking hunt this morning. These guys were up here roosted above us. And they were all roosted separate. And uh, they all flew down out in the field, and then they were fighting right out by the truck. And they just couldn't resist it for a second day in a row. I'm just assuming that these are the same Jake's as yesterday. Um, I knew we were going to come in and kill one of these things today. I knew we were. What do you think? I'm happy. Uh huh? I'm happy. I think it's a good morning, good start to the day. How many birds did we hear this morning? We heard this one back here. I think there was another one over there. There was another one up higher. And he had two with him. And there was two or three, because there was one flew down here, one flew down here. Yeah. And then the other one come up from over here. Yeah. I thought so, I was gonna kill. I watched that first one fly down. I was like, I thought sweet, he was gonna this come running right in and here. And then I saw that other one fly down. I was like, oh sweet, this is it. And then those two deer walked in. And yeah. Like, and then there was. And these guys shut up. I didn't know. There's another were. long beard. Way off down, down that way. Mm -hmm. That I heard too. He had a full gobble, but. What do you think? That Very was happy. pretty sweet. Mhm. Mm Good first bird. I've never heard him really like fight like that no that was cool glad you saw them because i because awesome. they shut right up when they came in i don't know where they came from they must have come around this right here they must have come around there's like a little berm mm -hmm. right here they must have come around the side of that because i never heard them and i was looking right yeah. quite a bit to just you know because i knew there was a good possibility they might try to sneak up right on us uh-huh and with the other birds gobbling in the area these ones might not gobble as much yeah being the subordinate birds but look at that freaking awesome 
I'm pretty sure the video you said, which one? And I said, it doesn't matter. Well, yeah, because I, I couldn't see beards or anything. I just, I, I could tell right away they were all digs. Where's that one? There's one right up here. Yeah, that's, oh, that's the, his the brother. Jake. See, oh, I can see it. Let's just walk in. Oh, yeah. Dad, you can't get one one in a day. Let's go. I thought. Oh, there he is. Right there. He's out in that same field that he was in yesterday morning. Look at that. Well, we'll get your tag filled out and then uh, we'll get a tag on them and then Some pictures. we'll see if there's any other birds answering us. And yeah, a lot of good pictures. I want to wait till the sun comes up a little bit, but what do you think? What do you got to say to people? I'm very happy with my first bird. <laughs> I couldn't be any happier myself. Heading back in. I'm by myself. You can only shoot one turkey in a day here in New York. So I'm heading in by myself to a new spot. Um, I might try that. I might go back to where we were this morning and try that gobbler that was gobbling. Um, but I need him to lose his hand, so that won't happen until later in the morning, anyways. I'm gonna try a couple different spots and uh, see if I can get lucky. So stay tuned. I'll keep you guys updated. I've been sitting at this spot for a while. And I've just been listening and just calling every now and then. I just got done calling. And I could hear something in the leaves. And then I didn't even, there's these two trees right here. Right where I have my decoy bag. There's this tree and then the other one. They were coming in right behind them trees. <clears throat> So when they finally stepped out, 
they were like 15 yards. And all I could see was red and white heads. I almost pulled up and just shot. Clearly a Jake or a Tom, but, but I couldn't tell. I mean, they come totally silent, never made a peep, but I didn't hear them until they were walking in the leaves right here. I'm glad to see this many Jakes running around because that means we're gonna have birds for next year. I hope we have another good hatch because we could use a couple good hatches. So that was cool regardless. I haven't heard anything and I think it's about, it's 10 o'clock. So I think what I'm gonna go do is uh, I'm gonna pack up and get out of here. And uh, I'm gonna go check one more spot before I head home. Because we gotta quit by noon, so. I've only been sitting here for maybe, well, I should say only. I've been sitting here for probably an hour. And I've just been listening and calling and seeing if I can't. Yesterday, my grandpa was hunting down the road and he said he heard three of them, so. I don't know, maybe it was them three Jakes, but he said he was pretty convinced they were long beards, so. I don't know. I think I'm gonna pack my stuff up and uh, see if I got enough time to run into another spot real quick. But we'll see. All right, everybody, we're back home. Um, I went to several other spots. I didn't video anything because. Uh, well, there was nothing to video. So, um, I went to a bunch of different spots. There was boot prints everywhere. There was trucks parked in places. So, um, that's going to be it for today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Um, I definitely enjoyed it being able to get my girlfriend her very first turkey ever. So, that was a ton of fun. I'm extremely excited about that. And, uh, I can't wait to share the experience with you guys. So, if you haven't, please go down, hit that subscribe button. It really helps me out a lot. And, uh, We'll see you in the next one. I'm going to be going out before work a couple times this week, I hope. So we'll see you then.